All right, today we're gonna to be unboxing the Chiapa Firearms Nebula Rhino 60DS. It's gonna ship in this nice uh, hard plastic case. This is a revolver chambered in a 357 Magnum. So we'll start off with, this, uh, with the accessories over here on the side. First up in the box, we're gonna get a nice uh, Velcro patch. We'll also get two stickers. That one, as well as this one. Get a little accessory bag. So in here you're going to find your rear sight adjustment tool, that black one right there. You'll get three moon clips to aid in the loading process, and then one uh, deloading tool. you also get this cleaning brush. Two booklets on firearm safety from the National Shooting Sports Foundation. And your Rhino Revolver Manual. This manual is going to cover all the different Rhino uh, models, and there's, there's a bunch of them, uh, as you can see here. Uh, so, you know, the, the pictures aren't going to directly match up with your firearm per se, or the one we're discussing today, but it's a, it's a pretty detailed manual. It's got some pictures in there. It's got, uh, you know, parts, schematics and whatnot. But here's your manual. You also get a lock, and this is a uh, trigger well style lock. Like that. It'll come with your keys as well. So, this particular Rhino is in a special, um, we call it the Nebula Edition, it's the best way to describe it. It has a multicolor PVD finish, Let's see if we can get some close-up shots there. It's a really nice finish throughout, it's pretty even as well, like on the top there. Pretty cool finish overall. It's your grips. So the grips featured here are going to be a blue laminate, and these are the medium grips. Now on Chiapa's website, they also sell the grips in a small and large. Uh, like I said, this one is the medium. It's a pretty nice grip. It's got some finger grooves right there in the front. So this gun's gonna also feature uh, fiber optic rear as well as front sight. That front one is gonna be a uh, like a reddish in color. Then that rear one is gonna be a green color. And this gun is single as well as double action. So you can uh, either cock the hammer back or you can uh, pull the trigger and you'll get that double action longer trigger pull This gun's gonna feature a steel cylinder and it is a six shot cylinder and uh, One thing is that it is manual unloading, so there's no uh, you know uh, I guess Button that's gonna unload all the all the rounds Overall, pretty interesting design here. Uh, one thing to note is, and this is you know specific to the Rhino, is that uh, unlike traditional revolvers where you would fire from the top cylinder, this one fires from the the uh, bottom of the cylinder. So what's cool about that is the barrel 
is lined up very much with where your hand and your finger is going to be so that it's got a very low bore axis is pretty much what they were trying to achieve here and they did a great job so as you can see my fingers lined up right there with that barrel you can have picatinny on the top as well as on the bottom you know for mounting of your lights optics lasers whatever you want to do this lever back here is going to release your cylinder and that barrel is a six inch steel barrel overall pretty interesting firearm here and like I said that uh, in that accessory bag you're gonna get a rear sight adjustment tool and so you can adjust it for uh, windage and elevation right there on the side and on the top and they also on their website they also sell uh, you know different colored uh, fiber optics so that you can change those out pretty cool all right if you guys have any questions let me know down in the comment section thank you for watching